Okay, so here we have Kali Linux, which I downloaded from their website, and I'll bring up their actual web page within within the actual VM that I'm running here. Okay, so this is a virtual machine, so it's a little bit slower than it normally would be. But if you were to go out to Kali's website, which is Kali.org, okay, this is the, a reincarnation of Backtrack, which is uh, a pen testing tool and a, a Linux distribution that's kind of geared towards security. So if you're familiar with Backtrack, this is kind of the newer uh, version of that tool set. Okay, so Kali Linux, and from there you would go to Downloads, and then Custom Kali Images. So if you're running VMware, this is a great way to get up and running quickly. All right, so you click on that, it will bring you over to this web page from Offensive Security. And then from there, you can download uh, custom ARM images and also VMware images. All right, so you just pick one for your specific VMware uh, flavor of choice. And from there, once you install it, which is basically what I have running here, now you're up and running with Kali Linux, and you can explore all the things that it has to offer. So under Applications, down under Kali Linux, this is where all the good stuff, all right? This is all the mag <laughs> where all the magic happens. So we have the top 10 security tools. And again, it's out of the scope really of this course to, to go into any of these in any depth. But I wanted to make you aware of where they're located and how to get your hands on a, a copy of Kali Linux so you can kind of explore on your own. All right, so from, from the, uh, the fuzzing testing tools that I was referring to, that will be under vulnerability analysis and then down under fuzzing tools. All right, so you see there's a number of ones available. Uh, there's also like Cisco tools, database assessment tools, uh, reverse engineering, stress testing, exploitation tools. Okay, so there's a lot of stuff here. So if you're interested in really digging in, I highly recommend that you download this application or this uh, distribution of Linux, I should say, and then start exploring the applications that are inside here. All right, so I just want to make you aware of where these things were located.